Hey everyone, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can install a latest version of a Dupilot Autopilot software on Pixar 6C or a custom version of this firmware on Pixar 6C using a mission planner. Sometimes when you're working on drones and making them a limitless range using a 4G internet or making them object detection and tracking, adding a component computer, in those certain projects, uh, sometimes you might require a custom firmware of the Autopilot Autopilot software. For these certain requirements, I'm gonna show you how you can do both using Emission Planner. Let's get started. Connect your Pixar 6C to the computer, then open Mission Planner. And if you are first time doing this, uh, you probably connect here directly to the mission planner then go to setup and you will see this message you can upload a new firmware while connected manual link please disconnect so this is a common mistake when you are not familiar with the mission planner you do it do the first time just disconnect it then this window appears where you can update your firmware as you can see on the top my flight controller have a current version of 4.5.0 and I'm using this flight controller on hexacopter so it has a new version of 4.5.7 just simply click on it and are you sure you want to upload your copter option yes simply click on it and it start downloading then update your Pixar 6 flight controller So once the upload is done, that means our flight controller is successfully updated to the new version. When it's done, simply restart your flight controller by disconnecting it and simply connect. Here, as you can see on the top, my current version of the flight controller is 4.5.7 in this way we successfully uh, updated our flight controller to the less, latest firmware of the Arduino pilot and you can go to here setup and disconnect it again you can see here two options install firmware and install legacy firmware so install firmware means you can install the latest version of the firmware of the Arduino pilot into your flight controller and install firmware legacy means you can uh, upload the old firmware versions or custom firmware versions and here if you want to find a custom firmware versions you can simply click on download firmware and it will directly go to the Arduino pilot website where you can select what type of vehicles you have and in my case I have an exacopter I click on copter and I scroll down I want to go to this stable 4.5.0 version and click on it here the list shows the different types of flight controllers available and here I'm using Pixar 60 so I scroll down so here's my flight controller and you can see here there are three versions of the software of the 4.5.0 and the first first version is adducopter.apj this is the file we need to download if you are using a mission planner or QG ground control station software so this first file we need to download it click on it it will download automatically and the second file adducopter.elf is a file used for software developers where they want to check the current version have any bugs or if they want to try with some adding new features and here adducopter with bl.hexa this type of file used for old flight controllers where the flight controllers doesn't have a bootloader and requires a bootload software and all the new flight controllers such as pixoc 6c pixoc 6x have a 
dedicated bootloader can run the Hadoop copter.apg file very easily. So once you download this file, just go to load custom firmware, click on it, and here the file I downloaded. Note that my current version is 4.5.7, and I try to downgrade it, and it's updating again. So upload is done. Simply restart your flight controller to view the current version of the software. Click on connect. Here the current version of the flight controller which we loaded the custom file and we downgraded the firmware version from 4.5.7 to 4.5.0 in this way you can update your pixel 60 to the latest version or you can also downgrade it to a custom firmware version to the requirements of your product